Hi everybody. In this video I'm going to show you how to load camera controls, a very powerful camera control that you can use instead of orbit controls in 3JS. It's got lots of worked examples and if you click it it will take you to a working example. There are lots of things that you can control. Many many things. This is a very powerful camera control. And look at all the events that you can listen for when you're using the camera controls. It's very flexible and you can configure the mouse button and wheel with different behaviors which makes it, this camera control very flexible so if you're looking for a very adaptive and powerful camera controls that you want to use for your 3JS project this is it so how do we get these camera controls first we're going to download the file and the second step is we're going to upload that file into our code editor and then the third step we're just going to add it some code to make it work Let's download this camera control. The link for this GitHub page is in the description below. It's in the dist folder, and I want camerocontrols.module.js. I'm going to click that, and here's my file. I want the raw file, and I'm just going to right click and hit save as, and save it to my device. Now I just need to load it into my code editor. Here's my code editor. I'm just going to drag and drop the camera controls module into my modules folder. Now it's added to my modules folder. Now we just need to add code to make it work. So in the script tag where I have imported 3.module.js, I'm going to import the camera controls. So just import camera controls from and the path where the camera controls module.js is located. And then you're going to have to install it using the camera controls dot install. So now we just have to create a clock, create a new instance of the camera controls, and update the camera controls. So here I'm creating a new clock. Const clock is equal to new 3.clock. So I'm creating and starting a clock to keep track of time. And then I'm creating a new instance of camera controls. So const camera controls is equal to new camera controls, and I'm passing in the camera and the render. Dot dom element, the canvas that 3GS is creating. If you have defined a canvas element, then you would just put canvas in there instead of render.dom element. In the animate loop, you're going to update the time and update the camera controls. So here, cause delta is equal to clock get delta. So it's just updating the time by the amount of seconds that has passed. And here I am updating the controls. So const task controls updated is equal to the camera controls. And I'm updating it with the amount of time that has passed. And that's it. And that's how you can set up this very powerful camera controls.